Hello investors, this is a video on Paisalo Digital. This video is brought to you by Smart Investor. Like our videos, share our videos, and subscribe to our channel. Click on the bell icon for new video notifications. This video is for education purpose only. For any investment decisions, please consult your financial advisors. In this video, we will cover the analysis of the company for the second quarter FY24. Assets under management is at 38,174 million, year on year growth of 28%, revenue is at 2,809 million, a growth of 21% year on year, net worth has gone up by 12,413 million, a growth of 11%. A good quarter for the company across balance sheet is growth, portfolio quality and profitability. A snapshot of the company operations profit after tax is at 859 million year on year growth of 90% car is at 39.74% nnpa is 0.01% a good quarter for the company across balance sheet growth portfolio quality and profitability let us look at the snapshot for second quarter of 24 highest ever aum of 38179 million rupees AUM as at second quarter of 24 was up 28.24% at 38,174 million as against second quarter 2023 at 29,767 million. Total geographic footprint stood at 1714 touch points across 18 states in the second quarter. The company added 337 new touch points. The company continues to protect its margin profile. Interest income for second quarter of 2024 was up 20% at 2,809 million as against 2,329 million in second quarter of the previous year. The company has posted 88.46 increase in PBT and 90.61 increase in profit after tax year on year. GNPA and NNPA stood at 0.24% and 0.01% as at second quarter of 24 compared to 0.76% and 0.27% in the previous year. The company expects GNPA and NPA to stay within the long term outlook below 2%. The snapshot of the company include a uh, company has written off bad debts totaling 36 million rupees and has recovered old return of debts worth. 260 million in second quarter of 24. This impact has 224 million Indian rupees added to the bottom line of the company. The tangible net worth is 12,413 million rupees versus bank borrowings at 13,740 million, which is 1.11 times. Capital adequacy remains strong at 39.74% in second quarter of 24. Credit rating of the company has been upgraded to IVRAA stable outlook and a reaffirmed IVR A1 plus for commercial paper. In second quarter, the company analyzed ROE for 13.70% as against 7.95% in second quarter previous year. In the second quarter, the company delivered annualized ROE of 5.14% as against 3.01% in second quarter FY23. Snapshot of the company continues. Employees at count stood at 2057 as of second quarter. Board of directors paid a dividend of 10% and fully paid equity shares of 1 rupee each. A good quarter for the company across all financial and portfolio metrics. Paisalo believes that the purpose of any business transformation is that it should result in stronger growth momentum, better customer experience, additional cross sell, lower credit risk lower ALM risk and improved liquidity. Companies pursuing business transformation with these objectives as articulated in previous quarters, all phase 1 features of the stock are alive. In the phase 2, the 3000 disbursements per day, phase 2 is on track, achieved 3000 disbursements per day in the month of March 2023, continue to focus on establishing 3000 disbursements per day under phase two of the business transformation for the next two quarters with focus credit underwriting feature set disciplined execution rapid adoption in all processes of the company and continued progress on all metrics before initial phase of 5000 disbursements let us look at the overview of the company the company has started disruption revolutionizing and disrupting rural credit High tech and high touch engage and transact without friction to deliver a sustainable business model. 
innovation focus on continuous innovation to transform customer experience and create growth opportunities business construct deliver at sustainable nnpa of less than 2% Key strategic differentiators, the company is a leader with a huge early mover advantage in co-lending, in-house proprietary digital platform, use data, AI and ML, a unique and scalable business model servicing 2.3 million customers, by a strong brand recognition in area of operations. The company has a team of 2,057 managing 1,714 touch points across 18 states in India. The company is uniquely positioned for growth, a leader with a huge early mode advantage, co-lending, offering easiest and cheapest product in its market segment, access to almost unlimited capital relative to size, negligible liquidity risk, negligible credit risk and negligible ALM risk. Let us look at the executive summary of the company engaged in the business of providing convenient and easy loans to the financially excluded at bottom of India's economic pyramid, lending business with AUM of 38,174 million, already serviced more than 23 million customers, 2.3 million customers, an experienced team of 2,057 managing 1,714 touch points across 18 states, net worth of 12,413 million leveraged two times and CAR at 39.74 percent, pact of 859 million classified and regulated by RBI as non-deposit accepting systematically important middle layer for NBFCs. Rated AA stable outlook A plus 1 commercial paper listed on BSC and NSE. These are the financials of the company for second quarter of 24 and uh, let us look at the AUM is at uh, 38,174 million. Profit before tax is 1,156 million. Profit after tax is 859 million. Continue the financials. This is for quarter 1, quarter 2 of FI24. Tangible net worth as of second quarter of FI24 is at 12,413 million. Bank borrowings is at 13,740 million. Total outside liabilities is 20,447 million. These are some of the facts of the company in Q2 FI24. The revenue is at 2,809 million. AUM is at 38,174 million. Net worth is at 39.74% million and CAR at 39.74 net worth of 12,413 million. Let us look at the ROE and ROA. Second quarter of 24 is at 5.14%. ROE is at 13.70%. This is the shareholding pattern of the company. Promoters and other groups hold 32.97%. FIS and DIS hold 21.95%. Public hold 45%. Let us look at the stock performance in the last one year. Paisala Digital has risen sharply in the last one year. The share price is currently trading at 103, which is a year high of 113 rupees and a year low of 48 rupees. In the last one year, the script has gone up by 32%, a growth of 25 rupees. The last six months, the share price has gone up by 54 rupees, a jump of 111%. In the last one month, the share price has gone up by 5%. A jump of 5 rupees in its retail price. Currently trading at 103. The share price looks fully priced and we see not much of growth in this share. Investors should track and analyze the performance of third quarter FI24 before looking at investing in this stock. The company has a technical advantage of doing the business with the latest software and this can help the company to scale the business and operate profitably. This video is for in education purpose only. For all your investment decisions, please consult your financial advisor. This video is brought to you by Smart Minister. Like our videos, share our videos, subscribe to our channel. Click in the bell icon for new video notifications. Thank you.